Please welcome now, representing Russia, Irina Lobacheva and Ilya Averbuk. Back in Colorado Springs, the free dance continues. Your current leaderboard, Fusipoli, Morgalio of Italy in the lead over Vinkla and Lose of Germany, Silverstein and Pekarik of the U.S. in third. But here are the leaders after the original dance from Russia, Irina Lobacheva and Ilya Averbuk. This music is from Cirque du Soleil, and what they're representing is marionettes. It's funny, the opening is very similar to Winkler and Lose's, I would say, in terms of shapes and... This couple is always very expressive, equally. Sometimes the man gets lost a little bit in the make, but he really gives as much as she does. two years. Remember the reigning world champions, Krylov and Ovsyanikov, not here because of Angelika's back injury. Colorado Springs, one of the favorite sites for Ilya, though. He won a junior world championship 10 years ago here with his former partner, Marina Anasina. He's proud to tell us about that. He said, maybe I won the second time. <laughs> connections in terms of their upper body connections, their holds are a little bit more difficult than the Italian team, but they're not as fast as Fusar Poli and Margaglio. that spin go to town. <laughs> in the program, get the mechanics down. It doesn't look quite comfortable enough for them yet. They said this dance has a lighthearted feel. I'm not getting that feeling. And I forgot the altitude might be a little bit of a factor. I like them. I really want to like them. It just moved too slow. 
And it looks like it, it just needs to be worked out a little bit more. As compared to Fusipoli and Margalia, who are currently in first place? Yes. We'll wait and see what the judges think. Lobacheva and Averbuk of Russia in first after the original dance. This is their final lift. Nice dynamics, high to low. They're very capable. They're known for their unusual lifts, but this one in the actual performance was a little bit slow. So now the first set of marks for Lobacheva and Averbuk. There are the marks, and those are not as high as Fusar Poli and Margaglio. And that makes a lot of sense, because Fusar Poli and Margaglio skated very strong. They were hungry. And now the all-important presentation marks, 5.5 to 5.8, and those are not good enough. So the Italians in first place, Lobacheva and Averbuk, who were in first after the original dance, are now in second. But there's one team left. 